Some portion of Psalm 22. They do not all cite the first verse. So that's the first thing. If if they're all citing the text, why aren't they? And it's so important to cite every part of it if it actually is about Jesus. Why aren't they all so Mark citing? And Matthew do. Mark and Matthew. Do. They don't all cite, "My God, My God, why have you forsaken?" But Mark and Matthew. Right? Do. So two out of the yeah. three. Two out of the three. Two out of the But Luke also quotes various par parts of Psalm 22, so he clearly thinks it's about Jesus. So what is? Okay, Secondly, no, 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 you. No, I let I you finish. No, no, I, I, I let no, you finish. No, I don't know the the answer. To, I need you to answer this question. Yeah, yeah. I actually I'm don't answering know. it. I'm what answering. What does Luke it. say about yeah. Psalm 22? He, he quotes various parts, such as when they're wagging their heads and they're mocking him. And, but, and, but, but here's and his the point. clothes and his the interlocks. Dividing clothes. Okay. The, these different elements are mentioned by the gospel. Some of them are common to them all. One might mention one that is not mentioned by others or vice versa. Literary so, ministers. So this wrote yeah, yeah. to make a good so, point Jesus. So here's the thing. Well, that's the claim. But... But, so, so that's the first problem with your claim. They don't have to cite everything in the psalm in order to believe the psalm is about Jesus. Secondly, they do talk about him being nailed, which entails piercing. John talks about the nails that were put in Christ's hands. But thirdly, 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 here's the thing. I don't know where that story is in the other gospels. Thirdly, thirdly, why does every story have to record the same element? I find it strange as time goes on, you're adding more and more and more. Look, if I look at Surah 19, Surah 20, Surah 27 and 28 of the story of Moses, I find variation in the story. I don't criticize the Quran because one surah includes additional information not found in the other, or even sometimes reports some of it in a different order. Yeah. I, you know, so I just think it's, it's so glaringly obvious. I, and I would say, okay, then it's no, glaringly no, 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 obvious for me, that in glaring, Surah yeah, yeah, yeah. 19, 20, yeah. 27, and 28, yeah, yeah, yeah. we've got no, no, variations. No, no. I'm saying, I'm saying, but but let me finish my okay, point because you made it clear. I'm saying the movement. You made Mark, three. Okay, I'm saying the movement from Mark to John. It clearly shows higher Christology. Oh, you don't you don't want to go there. You don't want to go there. But Can I yeah, ask a question? Uh, um, Campbell. I first time here. Are you Christian? I am. Okay. And my question just is, why do you cover yes. your face? Oh, oh. Like, even they the just, police came and spoke to us. Actually, no. <laughs> no, I have they spoken to you yet? I want oh. you to I, say, why is your face covered? Um, your a, a lot of cameras. Big, big do, do, eyes. Yeah, I'll answer you. Um, I, I don't like having, there's a lot of cameras here. No, it's a normal I'm not, oh, okay. No problem, uh, for you maybe, for, for you maybe. Uh, no problem, no problem, thank you for your opinion. Okay. Um, thank so, you. thank you, thank you. So. Because they're violent people, man. They, 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 they don't have, have there you go. they don't have the we're same we're glowing people. visage, yeah, yeah, yeah. the same glowing that's visage not, that's not good. No, as no, me. Okay. Anyway, violent by nature. Anthony, are we violent, do you think? No. Anthony just said we're not violent, so it's okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and Anthony's not afraid of violence. No. <laughs> so he's from Buffalo <laughs> Park. <laughs> no, I grew up though in Southern California, like there Luke. Yeah, Luke yeah. was a gang member. South Central. We South had to say, that's no, right. You and I he was, uh, spoke about he it. He was further you? down, but but still, it's still a uh, South Central. Is that what it's South, South, South Central is like where L.A. is more uh, up up more in, in L.A. or in California. Okay. He's he's down in San Diego. Right. Which has its own, you know, rough comparable. Street situation. Yeah, and they thought he was Mexican as well. So. I... Oh yeah, 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 yeah. When I saw him, I I could have thought that myself. Yeah. Um, but it's easy to see that he's not too when he tells you. You know, once he tells you. But um, so anyways. Oh, yeah, here we go. I would be. I would be if I had to be. Uh, if I must be. If I uh, why, why are they concerned that you have a mask on? I don't know. Oh. I, I was only curious, just just out of curiosity. Well, I, I, not, obviously which, the police did come like and speak to us, oh. which I understand because you know they need to understand that there's not like a, a threat to yeah. yeah. which I get and I'm happy to. You know yeah. what they did Some to people they're like, oh yeah, it's because you're violent and they they, they keep badgering you like this. But yeah. it's okay. So I don't, I don't mind. Um, having a conversation, with Anthony, and I think it's been quite an amicable conversation. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot where we're at. Oh yeah, yeah. So, so these two, as you can probably tell, they don't get on these two. So here, here. Well, I wish I could. I don't know how long you have. 
uh, obviously, yeah, each thing we say, I, I don't know what I'm going to say. Each thing again. we say brings up another thing, and yeah, I think, oh, I'd love to talk about that. I'd love to talk about that. It's a good conversation. Yeah, why don't we just stick to a topic, man? No, no, no. You no, no. need a round table. You need a round table. Round table. <laughs> I, I, have you not got TikTok? Uh, I do, but I'm not, uh, like, I have 500 subscribers, so right. I can't no, do you the. You can't go live. I can't go live. You can get you on YouTube? I have YouTube, yes, yeah, YouTube. yes. Yeah, just put, on YouTube. No, not just that. Just put, put the, your um, TikTok name in the YouTube. And all your followers will just go over there. Yeah, I should. I mean, yeah. I put it on there, but people don't look. Hey, hey. Um, <laughs> Sorry. So, so, so you talked about the New Testament and they didn't say page. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm just saying uh, some gospel writers quote the first verse, some don't. Some quote other verses, others don't. So, for example, uh, in Matthew 27, Matthew quotes verse 8 of Psalm 22. The other gospel writers don't, but they quote verse 7 or they quote verse 9. So that, from our standpoint, isn't a defeater for the idea that Psalm 22 is about Jesus. Now, verse 16 not being quoted. Now, I didn't even tell you that my view is that the best rendering is pierced. I don't think it's like a lion. That's my point. Oh, I know, I know. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know you yeah, yeah. <laughs> because it's a gibberish reading in Hebrew when you look at it. It's in not even the, the standard spelling. But I'll, and I'm happy to show the commentators. Even when we get what off the Jewish when, when we get off this, I'll just pull up. I can pull up what Jewish, the Jewish commentators. commentators yeah, say? we can like do that. Who, who, what uh, Jewish commentator takes issue with the fact that it says like a lion? That man's Yeah. So, so we'll talk. I'll show you that. But here, but here's my point. Go on. I'm not even arguing that it it necessarily is pierced as opposed to like a lion. Here's the interesting thing. So the Septuagint says pierced, but there are that's not the only translation of the Old Testament from the Hebrew to the Greek. There are other Greek translations before Jesus, or Jesus not done by later, Christians. Actually, later? No, 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 it's before. Before what? Before Jesus. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Oh, the five books of Moses. No, no, no. The but, are before Jesus. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. The others so, are written by Origen. Yeah, yeah, but, no, no, no. No, no, no. The, no you're no, right, no. you're right. I, I, no, yeah. no, you're right, you're yeah. right in this, that the Septuagint technically the refers to the five books. Yeah. But it comes by extension to refer to the rest of the Old Testament translated into Greek, which wasn't done at the same time. So that much is right, true. Right. But it's still but before the Jesus. says 70 elders. Yes. They but, translated the five books of Moses. Yeah, yeah yes. Yes, that's technically true. But that doesn't the mean. Tole, t t but that the doesn't Ptolemy, mean. Ptolemy, the Tolem Ptolemaic. Yes, uh, but that doesn't mean the rest of the Old Testament wasn't <laughs> translated until after Jesus. Well, I don't know. You'd have yeah, to yeah. find the evidence, right? No, well, we have the evidence. Where's the evidence? Yeah, th th that was the whole point. We have Greek translations of the Old Testament from Codex before. Codex Vaticanus and Codex No, no, no those, those are later. Those yeah, are later. Yeah. Those what are fourth, those are fourth century. Uh, what, what I'm getting at is we have evidence that it was written, translated before that. But then. you have no physical the, the New Testament authors are quoting from it. Okay, but here, but here, let me make the point. Maybe, let me make the point. It, yeah. it, it, it's, it's irrelevant. It's still pre-Masoretic, right? Vaticanus and Sinaiticus are pre-Masoretic. Yes, I agree with you, 100%. 100%. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But, but that's not even my point, though. My point is this. My point is this. When you look at the translations of Symmachus, Aquila, Theodotion, <laughs> one of the renderings... One of the renderings, is it true that people, Sorry. that, that uh, some Muslims say that, that Jay has a gin in his throat? Have you heard that? I don't care. It's, it's the first time I've seen him in real life. Getting old? Yeah. Um, that it's happens. It yeah. does happen. Age, yeah. Uh, Even you, you, you get a bit, when I first saw you on uh, on the ship. How do you like the beard? It, yeah, yeah, it's good. Very Christ-like. <laughs> Very Christ-like. Um, yeah. Where's yours? <laughs> Come on, leave um, alone, man. You don't want to compare beards. Come oh, on. Man. Um, <laughs> No. Yeah, that's right. He'd be um, every time. I, I, I laugh, uh, no, because I remember watching this. Uh, do you know who Abu Musab is? Yes. He's, yes. Uh, he's in Jeddah, Muslim. I think it's One Message Foundation, I think. Or is oh, that? Yeah. No, the One Message Foundation is uh, Sheikh. Is that Uthman? Uh, it's, then it's something one, something, I think. Yeah, I, it's uh, the UK one, isn't it? No, he's in Jeddah. He's in Jeddah, okay. I'll but there's, a, there's an American Muslim, uh, Suhaib Webb. I know him. And they were in a in a argument way back, way back, and it's one of the funniest things I've seen. Uh, so Suhei <laughs> Webb, he's a big guy, right? Towers over the white him. White guy, right? Huh? Yeah. 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 But but a Muslim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. And uh, he's he's uh, chopping on uh, Abu Musab, and he's saying, you know, he's like he's teaching these little kids in the suburbs with his iMac and his credit cards from his parents or whatever. They're like going at it, right? And then. Uh, He's making fun of him and says, uh, I can say that because I'm 6'5 and I've got these fly shoes on. And he's basically saying, I'll stop him, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, but then Abu Musab, here he is over there. He goes, so what? He's 6'5, 5'5. He goes, so what? He goes, uh, 
he goes, he, he goes, look at that guy's beard. He goes, his tiny little beard. You know, he basically pulled out the Trump card. You know, my beard, my beard is bigger than than your beard. So, I've been waiting for the day. If I ever see Abu Musab, I'm going to tell him this yeah. debate is over. That's right. It's this a, debate is over because my the beard, beard, my it's beard, the beard. Yeah, 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 yeah. I do want to ask you a question, Anthony. Yeah, go ahead. I ask you a question. Um, I don't want you to feel like I'm just attacking Christianity here. Right? I, just, I actually just you're someone who you know. Uh, I listen to you. I watch you. You know Anthony Rogers. We all know you, right? It's Anthony Rogers, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Does it even sound similar to the other Rogers, the one who did that um, cartoon? Not the cartoon. He did um, the child thing. Oh, uh, so Bill Rogers, something uh, Rogers, I can't remember, something Rogers. Mr. Rogers. Mr. Rogers, yeah, that's yeah. it, okay. Um, <laughs> the irony is he was a Presbyterian minister. I'm oh, is he? A, I'm a Presbyterian minister. Oh, there you go, okay, well that makes sense. Um, so what, what I would say is, because I've, I've had this conversation with Bob the Builder quite a lot. And Which I, one? I am going to go to the New Testament now. Which this one? This will be the last thing that we can... No, no, after separate. that you ask him, did Muhammad spread the moon? No, you can ask him for the proof. Well, it'll be Please fair, it'll be fair that way. He's got a proof. What's this gimmick over here? This dude with the nose. Oh, it's the, the no, nose of London. Yeah, oh. he's, a, he's a waste of time. Okay. Anyway, he's just a troll. He came to me today and he said, oh, you should pay people to have your voice over. No, no, yeah, he's, he's a weird boy. Anyway, so, so what I would say is, I find it quite um, strange. According to the, the earlier Gospels, the Synoptics, we have Jesus being killed on, on the day after the Passover. Right? I'm sure you've heard this before. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. John yeah. supposedly it's changes it for theological purposes yeah. and so forth. What is your opinion on that? I, I think that there's a lot of technical stuff that goes in here. I don't think that there's a discrepancy, but it, it takes a bit to <laughs> explain what's going on. Right. One thing is that the gospel writers don't use the same time measurements as the... There's, there's different time reckonings in the New Testament. Right. You have the Roman reckoning, you have the Jewish reckoning. Right, and so, so for example, if you looked, I was just showing this to, uh, I don't know if you know who Seventh-day Adventists are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was talking to the Seventh-day Adventists. They keep the Sabbath, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, And on Saturday. Yeah, so, but in their view, it, the, a day begins in the evening and it ends the following evening. Yeah, or we, we agree with that. Well, but, with but that. so, but here's my, here's why I bring this up. That's not always the way the, the gospel writers are speaking. They're, they're not always assuming, because they're not always writing to the same audience. If, a, if another audience doesn't do time that way, it would only be confusing to them. Right. Right. So, if you look at John 20, verse 1, it says that as it began to dawn at the first day of the week, it talks about the women coming to the tomb. Right. But it calls that, calls that the first day of, of the week, the, as it began to dawn. So it's morning. Later in the Gospel, you'll remember that Thomas wasn't with them, and, and so we were already talking about this earlier. Yeah, the hands. And, well, yeah, and, show me the hands. So, yeah. Yeah, so setting all that discussion aside, yeah, yeah, course, yeah. but what it says is then he wasn't with them during the day when Jesus appeared to them. And then it says when it was evening, when the evening came, that same day, Jesus appeared to them. So here in John, he's not reckoning time from sundown to sundown. He's doing it from morning to evening. Right. They're part of the same day. Evening is a new day. And, and the same thing is true when you look at the, the, the hour measurements. Mark will talk about the sixth hour, the ninth hour. In in Roman reckoning, this means one thing. In Jewish reckoning, it means another thing. Yeah. So so part of the explanation is you have to be able to, to see what, what he's doing in terms of how he's measuring time and so forth. Yeah. And it's a little different than some of the other apparent discrepancies in the Gospels where at the Transfiguration, for example, Matthew will say, six days later, Jesus took them up the mountain, right? right? Luke's version says, about eight days, about eight days. He doesn't give a, he doesn't say eight days, he no, just no, says no. About, about eight days, but it all depends where you begin the count. You know, if, if, I, if somebody asked me, how long have you been here? It depends how, you know, do I count when I first arrived th that day, even though I, I, I landed here maybe 5 p.m.? Yeah, yeah, I get you. Do I count that as a whole day, and then the, the last day I'm here, what if I leave at 10 a.m.? Do I count that? I could do I could do either, spider. And, and, it not be, and it not be wrong. No, there's a spider on him? And it, uh, oh. Um, so I, I'm saying this factors into it. it it's not as if this sort of thing doesn't have a resolution right. and, and and I'm not pretending see I just I think when people look at this sort of thing though for me these aren't the big things because I can go to the Quran and I can find things and think this is a problem but my assumption is I honestly this is my assumption 
I, I, I don't believe that it makes sense to just jump to the conclusion the Quran is contradicting itself. That doesn't make sense to me even in a normal, uh, even if it's just a book that you wrote and, and you don't make any claim that it came to you from God. I think I, I'm supposed to find a way to understand it that could harmonize things and, and then if I can't, then that, you know, and the best thing is if I can ask you, right? But so it's the same thing with the Quran. Uh, when I look at the Quran, I don't just assume it, it you know, I see people sometimes, they, they say things, this is a contradiction, and I think, well, I can think of a way to explain that. I mean, okay, you know. I, by the way, I, I heard everything that you said, or what was said previously about, you know, the, the Roman timings, the different timings, and the, the time of the day, evenings, and, 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 and I'm pointing out partially how, how all complicated this a lot, a lot of this my, is. My issue is it that also It also has a different way of referring to the Sabbath. <laughs> the Sabbath can sometimes refer to the seventh day of the week, right. but it could also refer to a high day in, 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 a, Sabbath, yeah. in, in, in relation to certain feasts or festival occasions. Right. All this, comp because it doesn't stay the same, it all depends when the feast begins, and this shifts yeah. year to year. So these sorts okay, of things... Let me ask you that, I've got to ask you that. Okay. Is the Last Supper the Passover meal? So it's, it's Jesus taking that meal and giving it a New Testament meaning. But so whether it, even it, even if it, it takes Passover? place even if it takes place on, oh you're asking is it taking place they, on Passover? I'm just asking, are they eating the Passover meal that's for the last supper? That's what he's asking. Yeah. The so last supper is that the Passover meal that Jesus was eating? I, I would say it depends what you mean by is. It, I would say yes in the sense that this is what when Jesus is celebrating it with his disciples. Right. But if you're asking me, is it are they doing this when everybody else is doing that's it? What I'm is asking. that what you're asking? That's, that's asking. a different question. And, is it uh, the case? Uh, I don't have a definite opinion on that, honestly. Because obviously, if it is the Passover, yeah. and they're eating the Passover, the matzah, and you know everything. But, but the other thing is, yeah. But it, the, the sacrifice doesn't take place. It takes place the next day. Yeah. But remember, in John, when he's in front of Pontius Pilate, uh -huh. he, it says he's in front of Pontius Pilate, and it was the day of preparation for before the Passover. the Passover. Yeah. So. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not expecting you to give me an answer now. Yeah, yeah. Right? You know, go away and have, have a look at that sort of thing. But I think I think there is a case to be made, because you did mention it earlier. You said that it may have been for a theological reason. No, no I'm saying that's what oh, some people say, claim. That's what I, I'm going to say that. Yeah. Right? Because obviously, you want Jesus well, but, to but, but, with Moses, But what right? people say is, what people say is, John is making this up for a theological reason. But do you know what the theological but, reason is? But, but, well, you're going to say to make him the Lamb of God and so forth. The Passover Lamb. Right, yeah, yeah. The Passover Lamb. But, but, understand, it, it doesn't prove the non-historicity if one takes that. You don't have to say, because this has theological import, therefore John is making it up. No, I say, huh? I say, I say, I say who does? Okay, whose whose mic is this? Who's, whose mic is this? Who's in the prank? It's an emergency. Call the police. Why? Yeah, I've seen him. Oh, where's Manzur going? I thought Manzur was coming over here. Whose mic is this? Is this yours? Hey, Anthony. That's I know. Talking it was great talking to you. Appreciate it, man. O V. O O B. O B. Yeah, okay. you, a, you just have a look at his. At least you. Uh, at least you, uh, you. You let him talk. That's good. I, yeah. I, you know what? I, 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 enjoyed, enjoyed, I enjoyed every bit of it. Go home and think about the Passover meal. Don't worry about the Passover. Don't worry about it. Go go home and think of uh, Muhammad's okay. lamb. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 I got three fancy packs of tea. Wow, thank you. Share with everyone. Thank you. Why, why did you guys die? You guys leave it? Yeah. Huh? Photo. Oh, yeah. There you go. Cool deal. Wait, whose mic do I have? Okay, uh, you have a. I know whose mic that is. I know whose mic. This is yours, right? Yes. So now, let me ask you something. The, the one about the Passover meal. So can you do, give us like a? Uh, well, I, I'd rather do it in a detail. Be, that my whole point to him was, there's all sorts of details that one has to pay attention to in order. To, and it, it doesn't. It doesn't uh, uh, allow for a, a quick answer. It, it, you have to follow the steps as you're moving through the gospel and see what John is doing. Mm. So. I'd rather just do it on my channel. All right, that's fine. That's as, a, as a longer thing. As a longer thing, so we'll be yeah. looking forward to that. Yeah. Very good, thank you so much. Yeah.